Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Access. In this module, I want to show you how you can automatically open a form when you open a database. So in this example, I want to set it so that the main menu form automatically opens and displays like this. You can also set it so it just displays and only shows this and you can hide all of this sort of stuff, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to show you the process of setting that up and I'm going to show it in two different ways one using options and one using a macro so let's go for the options first so if you go to file options in here on the current database tab you've got the option to display a form on open so if I drop this list down it gives you all the forms that you have these are all categorized so main menu is the form I want that's what I want it to do. I want it to open that. And then you can take some of these ticks off if you don't want these things to display. Um, always careful when you do this, like the navigation pane, this, you can hide that. Um, and then you can bypass it on open if you want. But you've got different options to tick on or off, allow menus, detect menus off. But I'm going to leave all those on just for ease. But quite often in a database, you do get those hidden. And sometimes it can cause users a bit of a problem, but um, obviously it's for a safety reason, so people don't mess about with things. But for now, I'm just going to leave it like that. Click OK. And it says there I must close and reopen it, so we'll do that. So File, Close, and then File, Open. And that one. And there you go. It opens the main menu and it sits ready to go. So I'll just close that down. So that's one way of doing it. And I'm just going to remove that. Options, current database, put that back to none and then OK. Now the other way I said was to create a macro to do it. So let's have a look at that one. So click on create macro and click in there, open form is what I want. So the form name is going to be main menu again form you've got filters there's no filters no data on that it's just a, a form so that's all I really want but the key to this one is how you save it or what you name it as so if I click on save this one is going to be called auto exec like so click OK to that what that means that name that this macro will run on file open so if I do the same thing again and close this, close, and then open it, file, that one. It opened it straight away, and the macro ran and opened that form. So there's two different ways of doing it. You can actually get it to hide all of this if you want, the ribbon. And oh, I've already said you can hide this navigation pane as well. But also make sure that your forms have all the functionality that your users might need. Because hiding the ribbon and things like that is great. You might think you're being clever and safe. But if the user can't use the full function functionality of access, you're defeating the purpose of doing that. So you must be careful what you hide and what you don't hide. But that's all I want to talk about in this little video. Two ways of automatically opening a form. One with options and one with a macro. So hopefully... That quick video was of use to you. Thank you for your time and I'll see you on the next one.